Imagine having the power to absorb knowledge like never before in a world that demands constant learning. Let's explore the depths of knowledge and share valuable insights to help you enhance your learning abilities and overall life. Today, we have an extraordinary journey ahead as we delve into the fascinating world of accelerated learning guided by renowned neuroscientist Andrew Huberman. Have you ever wondered how to supercharge your learning process? Are you tired of spending countless hours studying with minimal results? Well, in the next few minutes, you will get to know the secrets to learning faster and more efficiently. And let's kick things off with a remarkable discovery. The 20 minute nap hack. Recent studies have shown that taking a short nap within four hours of learning can turbocharge your learning process. Your brain goes into overdrive, replaying neurons at an astonishing speed up to 20 times faster than usual. This means you get more repetitions of the information and your brain rewires itself at an accelerated pace. We're showing that people who take a 20 minute nap within the four hours after triggering learning, they learn much faster. In other words, the brain rewires much faster. There's a replay of the neurons very fast at something like 10 or 20 X the speed that the normally they would be rehearsing it. So you're getting more repetitions. Now let's dive deeper into what deliberate learning entails. Deliberate learning is all about actively engaging with new information, whether it's a language, a skill, or any knowledge you wish to acquire. Unlike passive learning, which happens naturally, deliberate learning requires intention and effort. Now, children are learning passively all the time. They're taking in new information. Their brain is it's not a complete tabula rasa. It's not a complete blank slate. There's some hardwired functions they show up with, like breathing, <laughs> like heart rate, heart uh, controlling heart rate. That helps. But that helps. I mean, you know, offload a, the, as much as you can to the genetic program to hardwire the nervous system so they can learn how to walk. And walking is a good example. A kid learns how to walk and then walks reflexively. But of course, at any stage, you can think about how you're walking. That, that's this uh, flexible transition between voluntary and involuntary movement. But you have to learn how to walk. Think of a child learning to walk. Initially, it's a conscious effort, but with practice, it becomes second nature. You know, and what we're focusing on here is deliberate learning. Now let's unravel the science behind this accelerated learning process. It all starts with neurotransmitters like dopamine, norepinephrine, um, and the star of the show, acetylcholine. Acetylcholine is crucial because it acts as a highlighter in your brain marking specific neural connections for potential strengthening. Imagine you're learning a new language, let's say conversational French. As you intensely focus on specific words or phrases, your brain releases more acetylcholine in areas responsible for pronunciation, comprehension, and even writing. These areas are flagged as potential change zones. And the actual rewiring of your nervous system happens during deep sleep or sleep-like states. And this, important, this is when your brain solidifies those newly marked connections, um, transforming them into lasting knowledge on deep or sleep-like states. So when we say neuroplasticity, the brain's ability to change and response to experience, that's a two-part process. It's a process, it's not an event. We always think about things as events, but in biology, almost everything is a process. The, the takeaway from this is in order to learn at any age, most critical thing is that you bring as much focus and active engagement to the learning, the, the encoding of the information, bringing in the information, and then that you get into a state of deep rest as quickly as possible. Typically, that would be the night after you learn, uh, after you have this trigger. But there are some beautiful studies published in Cell Reports last year and the year before showing that people who take a 20 minute nap within the four hours after triggering learning, or people that do a non-sleep deep rest type protocol, even just sitting there quietly and not doing anything, they learn much faster. In other words, the brain rewires much faster. Yeah. Completing focused 90 minute bouts of learning can be incredibly satisfying. It's a natural process that your brain and body were designed to do. Focused learning enhances retention and understanding and it improves memory consolidation, making information easier to recall. Concentrated attention leads to faster progress and mastery. Deep focus minimizes distractions and boosts productivity. Focused learning sessions should ideally last around 90 minutes, avoiding interruptions such as checking your phone enhances learning, cultivate a conducive study environment for optimal focus. Let's move forward and explore more strategies for efficient and accelerated learning. These techniques are not just theoretical, they're practical and you can start implementing them today. One essential element in the journey of accelerated learning is, is curiosity. Culter, um, cultivate a genuine interest in the subject you're trying to master. When you're genuinely curious, your brain becomes more receptive to new information. It's like a sponge ready to soak up knowledge. To foster curiosity, ask questions, explore related topics, and seek connections between what you're learning and your real life experiences. Curiosity ignites the brain's reward center, encouraging you to delve deeper into your studies. Another proven technique for accelerated learning is active recall. This practice strengthens strengthens neural connections and enhances your ability to recall information when you need it. To implement active recall, try using flashcards, teaching the material to someone else, or simply closing your notes and explaining the topic aloud as if you were teaching a class. Maintaining focus. 
One effective strategy is the Pomodoro Technique. The Pomodoro Technique helps combat the natural decline in attention that occurs during long study sessions. It keeps your mind fresh and engaged. Plus, knowing that uh, a break is just around the corner can boost your productivity during those 25 minutes. To make your learning stick, consider embracing spaced repetition. This technique involves reviewing and revisiting information at increasing intervals over time. It's a proven method for long-term retention. Find a quiet, comfortable space, it fry from distractions. Keep it organized and clutter-free to minimize cognitive load. A toolbox of strategies for accelerated learning, cultivate curiosity, embrace active recall, experiment with the Pomodoro technique, and harness the power of spaced repetition. Create an optimal study environment and don't forget the importance of a 20-minute nap. Thank you for joining us on this enlightening journey into accelerated learning. If you found this video valuable, please give it a thumbs up and share it with fellow learners. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more insights and practical tips on a wide range of topics. Stay curious, keep learning, and until next time, take care.